Her birthday's romantic dinner is almost over, and you are ready to sit down and digest that nice meal, watch some Netflix, and chill. But Mother Nature had other plans for you this evening. Power outage. Now, the nice thing about a gas stove during a power outage is that it will still work. Gas will still be delivered to your house. Now, did you know telephone lines will still, most likely, work during a power outage? If the blackout only affects your neighborhood or the phone line station is not affected, phone lines will still work. What else uses phone lines? Internet! Now, what do you need to maintain an internet connection? A modem and a router. In newer devices, sometimes both of these will be part of the same device. Okay, so we need to power a modem and a router. How do we do that? Well, if you have a generator, that won't be a problem. But not everyone has one handy. Luckily, there's a wonderful invention called a UPS, which stands for Uninterruptible Power Supply. They are basically a power bar with a giant battery attached to them. They are often used on computers or servers that are critical to a system, so they do not power down during a power outage until they can be either safely and properly shut down or until generators kick in. So we have a UPS meant to power a computer. UPSs come in many different shapes and sizes, which determines the size of the battery inside, which in turn determines how long the computer can run on battery power. Now the good thing is, we only need to power a small modem and router to maintain our internet connection. So even the smallest UPS should be good for a minimum of an hour of internet during a blackout. Plug everything in and now you can use your laptop, smartphone or tablet, anything that is battery powered, to stream your favorite Netflix show. Congratulations you romantic stud muffin, you've just saved her birthday. <laughs>